Further progress with piloted driving. During test drives on the Autobahn A9 near Ingolstadt, Germany, Audi demonstrated that a car can now even show social competence. All the driving maneuvers performed by the research car Jack were performed with consideration for other road users. The piloted Audi A7 signals upcoming lane changes by activating the turn signal and moving closer to the lane marking, just like a human driver would do. International media representatives were impressed. Es war erstaunlich, wie schnell man sich daran gewöhnt, äh, an das System, wie schnell man dem Auto vertraut. Situation is really, uh, amazing. S smooth, soft. Keine Zweifel, ich hatte da keine Angst. Ich habe erst gedacht, ich werde so ein bisschen ängstlich sein und dahinter sitzen und denken, oh, aber gar nicht. Also man vertraut der Technik super schnell. High Performance Processors evaluate the signals from all the sensors in the vehicle, which means the piloted Audi A7 always has a precise image of its surroundings. The Bavarian Minister of State, Ilse Eigner, sees technical progress for herself and lets technology <laughs> take over at the wheel. Ja, also ich habe da immer großes Vertrauen immer in die Technik, weil ich weiß, dass äh, das mit mehrfachen Redundanzen nach ausgestattet ist und man da wirklich sich darauf verlassen kann auf die Technik. Und deshalb bin ich da eigentlich sehr entspannt reingegangen. In other words, autonomous driving is possible already. Once the legal obstacles have been overcome, this will soon be a normal sight in road traffic. Audi is a front-runner in piloted driving. It is a success story with many historical milestones. 2009, a TTS drives on the Bonneville Salt Flats in the U.S. state of Utah and sets a world record speed of 210 kilometers per hour for autonomously driving vehicles. 2010, a driverless Audi TTS handles the peak's 20 kilometers and 156 curves using differential GPS with a precision tolerance of just a few centimeters. The 2013 CES in Las Vegas, Audi receives a license for driverless driving in Nevada. Audi impressively demonstrates the car's everyday practicality in traffic jams and in parking. In 2014, Audi already introduces the ZFast Driver Assistance Module at CES. It is merely the size of a laptop and represents another milestone toward production maturity. In August and September 2014, Florida and California approved testing of piloted driving. Audi conducts extensive tests in highway driving. October 2014, a driverless Audi RS7 takes a lap on the Grand Prix course at the Hockenheim Ring racetrack. Top performance at the limits, which can only be achieved with maximum precision on such a high-speed course. Bobby is absolutely away. The first piloted car here at the Hockenheim Ring. As the tens of thousands of fans here witness history in the making from Audi piloted driving. The absolute optimum lap as the car comes to a stop now. That was truly awesome. After its great success on the Hockenheim Ring track, Audi also showed just how reliable this technology is on highly challenging race courses in other parts of the world. January 2015, an Audi A7 Sportback piloted driving concept car drives from San Francisco to Las Vegas, a genuine long distance test of over 900 kilometers. The A7 brakes, accelerates, changes lanes, and overtakes other cars on the highway without driver intervention. Journalists are impressed by the reliability of piloted driving at Audi. April 2015. German Federal Minister of Transport Alexander Dobrindt personally tests piloted driving under real conditions on the A9 Autobahn. In complex situations, schwierigst situations, reagiert this auto autonom and self-standing. I'm sure 
Die Autofahrer werden sich darauf freuen. Es ist äh, ein echtes Meer an äh, Spaßfaktor, was beim Autofahren äh, dazu kommt. May 2015. Test of stamina in the mega city. For the first time, journalists experience piloted driving in a large metropolis. Under conditions of heat, smog, potholes and highways that run above one another, the Audi RS7 piloted concept shows how it can handle even the toughest of conditions.